Now, this may not be the best zip code in Charlotte, but it is certainly one of the most affordable. And right now, they are experiencing some rapid growth in zip code 28215 right here in Charlotte. I saw it firsthand myself the other day. I was actually went to a listing appointment with a friend of mine. We're gonna be putting her house on the market here in the next couple of days. And one of the reasons she wanted to move is because right there off of the Plaza Extension where she lives, the traffic is gonna get crazy. I counted at least three new construction neighborhoods that are being built, mostly townhomes, but a few single family right down the street from where she lives the air is experiencing some tremendous growth right now in that zip code we've seen new construction from lgi homes true homes ryan homes lennar all in this area and now you've got Madame coming in true homes with another new community of townhomes coming in as well you've got smith douglas building right here eastwood homes listen this area right now mi homes century homes there's a lot of growth happening in 28215. And today we're gonna to talk about why that growth is happening in the zip code and why it could be a zip code for you to move into if you're looking for affordability and you're moving into the Charlotte Metro. Stay tuned, I'll be right back. So welcome back. My name is Sean Gerald. I'm a local, I'm a native charlatan, as a matter of fact, a local real estate agent, and I am an investor, a brokerage owner, and I'm a U.S. Marine. To all my hard charges out there, simplified double dogs. Love to see you guys, man. Call me Marines, all right? Let's, let's catch up, man, all right? Now, if you serve somewhere else, Army, Navy, National Guard, Coast Guard, pick one. Listen, we love you too. And thank you for your service as well. Listen, I know a lot about VA loans because I've used mine a couple of times. So if you got questions about that, call me. But today in this video, guys, we're going to be talking about zip code 28215 and why it could be a great zip code for you. Now, I talk to people just like you every single day. You guys call me, you love up on me. I appreciate it. And I'm helping a lot of you transition to the Charlotte Metro. As a matter of fact, more than 200 people I've helped relocate into the greater Charlotte Metro. So it doesn't matter if you're moving here in nine days, nine weeks or nine months. I am here to serve you. My number is going to be in the description box below, but you can call me at 704-340-3822. And guys, please don't forget to like the video, share this video, hit that bell notification guys, subscribe to the channel. We put out videos like this at least twice a week and we love to share all things real estate happening in North Carolina, South Carolina, and in particular, the greater Charlotte Metro. So let's talk about zip code 28215 and some reasons for growth. And number one, I just mentioned it guys, it's gonna be affordability. Compared to other parts of Charlotte, Zip code 28215 offers relatively affordable housing options, making it a popular choice for first time home buyers and families looking for more space without some of the higher price tags you see closer to Uptown Charlotte. As a matter of fact, if you drive through the zip code, it's very rural. You're gonna see that in some of the B-roll playing throughout this video. You've got lots of trees, lots of forests. Listen, I, I was driving out there today, riding down Rocky River, and I had a freaking deer trying to cross the road in broad daylight this afternoon, okay? He's scared the heebie-jeebies out of me. I don't want to hit Bambi, and I definitely don't want Bambi jumping in my car trying to ride with me. But you got great affordability out here. You're not going to get, you know, some of the premium finishes. For example, you know, hardy board siding, you know, which is cement fiber. Slightly better product than vinyl, depending on who you ask. The builder that is using a hardboard siding over here is called oh empire <laughs> okay this should be called shea homes but but and shea is back in south carolina but empire homes in their community called kennington they are using hardboard siding and one community called hampton woods about eastwood homes they're using hardboard siding in that community as well but for the most part for affordability you're talking about in the three hundred thousand dollar price range mid 300s up to about four hundred thousand dollars you're going to get some vinyl siding but the homes are spacious they look great the the updates on the inside are going to look wonderful as well all right infrastructure improvements okay the completion of significant infrastructure not again. I don't know why I get so tongue-tied. I'm from the country. Now that we talk real fast, 
Sometimes, man, okay? And sometimes my tongue, my brain is moving faster. And it's like my, my brain yeah. is moving faster than my mouth. But you've got some infrastructure projects, guys, that have been completed, such as the Blue Line extension. This is made for more accessible, okay? Made the area more accessible, further fueling interest from developers and home buyers. This extension has not only improved transportation options, but also attracted commercial investment and higher density residential product. You know what? Here's what I'm gonna do real quick. Let me wet my whistle, okay? Mm, I'm gonna grab a little bit of water here. All right, let me set that down. Man, the tongue is tired, the brain is moving fast today. Guys, it's Sunday evening, man. It's about to rain outside here in Charlotte. Having a great day today, okay? So forgive me. But guys, listen, you got a lot of infrastructure products projects <laughs> happening right now. So oh, how does it keep happening? I'm not I'm not editing this stuff out either. Okay. A lot of projects happening in the zip code. You got a lot of grocery stores in the area. Food line, Harris Teeter, you name it. Access to I-45. Okay. So we're gonna talk about proximity to uptown and the surrounding areas. Now if you're in the zip code and I was checking this out from one of my buyers moving up from Miami. He was thinking about buying a home over in Kennington and getting back to the airport is very important to him. They're world travelers, man, they're influencers and they're all over the place. But one of the things for them is getting back to the airport was really important. From Kennington, deep in that zip code, we can get to the airport in roughly 30 to 35 minutes, maybe 40 minutes or so. Back into uptown Charlotte, okay, takes you anywhere from 25 to 30 minutes depending on traffic, but you do have the I-45 loop. That loop would take you anywhere around the Charlotte Metro, okay? That loop opened up, gosh, man, what has it been? Maybe 20, 25 years it opened up, but man, oh man, that 485 loop is amazing because it opened up all the Charlotte, which allowed growth and development in places like zip code 28215 that back up to Cabarrus County. I'm telling you right now, a lot of the zip code is gonna be rural, but man, oh man, the prices you're gonna get for living in the zip code, absolutely amazing. We've got some massive communities that are being built over here right now. One of the larger ones are gonna be by LGI Homes. And I guarantee it, they're gonna have four and five bedroom homes under $400,000 when they open up. So stay tuned for that. I'll make sure you guys get a report on that when the time comes. But you've got a lot of recreational opportunities out here, guys. Shopping centers, employment hubs, you name it. You're gonna have fun if you move with the zip code and you're gonna save a lot of money and be able to get yourself a brand new home, okay? Let's talk about some of the pros and cons of living in this area, all right? Number one, new construction. You got a wide range of new homes, okay? Our residents over here are benefiting from modern amenities, energy efficient designs, and community features such as pools and playgrounds, okay? And because the zip code is growing, guess what? Your potential for growth as far as equity, okay, is gonna be very significant, all right? The area does continue to develop. Property values are gonna continue to likely appreciate, offering good investment for potential homeowners and investors alike. Now the zip code also boasts a suburban feel, guys. You got parks, you got schools, very family oriented communities, making this ideal for those looking to settle down in a more residential area that feels kind of rural. I can guarantee you're gonna hear roosters out there, you know, cock a doodle doing. Cock -a -doodle -doo. Yeah, yeah, I did it. Yep, you're gonna hear roosters out here waking you up in the morning. If you're like me, you're gonna wake the roosters up. Okay, I go to shake and get your tail up, rooster. All right? Well, that and waking up a rooster. You're gonna see that, you're gonna see deer, okay? You're gonna see some wildlife in areas like this. But if you like trees like me, you're gonna love living in zip code 28215, guys. But let's talk about some of the cons, okay? I just told you one of them at the very beginning. My friend is moving and gonna sell that home because she's afraid of the traffic. When you've got rapid development like that, it's gonna come with increased construction activity, which can lead to noise, and traffic congestion in, in certain areas. It's just gonna happen. You've got limited established infrastructure. So while the area is growing, some parts may still lack established infrastructure. So schools, shopping centers, while they are there, you don't have them in abundance like you do in other parts of Charlotte. But that doesn't mean anything. Those things are gonna come. Once you start driving around this area and you see all of the new communities that are coming, the city has no choice but to support this area with infrastructure, and I guarantee you, it is coming. 
Now, when we talk about home prices in zip code 215, all right, as of mid 2024, the median home price in this area was right around $389,000, okay? This reflects a 4% increase year over year. Now, the price range for a new construction home typically spans anywhere from the $300,000 range up to $500,000, depending on the size, features, and location within that zip code. So you've got a blend of affordability, new infrastructure, and modern housing options, making this zip code 28215 a hot spot for both developers, investors, and home buyers alike. Guys, listen, my name is Sean Drill. I want to shoot you a quick video because it shocked me riding through this area and seeing all the land that's being cleared, okay? There's one coming, I don't even know who it is because they just started clearing the trees out. We're gonna miss all those trees. I'm not a tree hugger, but I do understand the importance of having trees, okay? So we're gonna miss it, but I am really happy that we've got some affordability coming back to our city because Charlotte was getting outrageous. My name is Sean Gerald, guys. Please give me a call at 704-340-3822. We've got affordability coming back to our city, okay? We've got stabilized home prices coming back to our city. We've got interest rates potentially coming down this year. We've got builders offering massive incentives to buy a brand new home. Listen, call me right away. Let's talk about your options and let's get you in a new home this year or sometime in 2025. I'll talk to you guys soon. Hope you enjoy the video. Please comment below and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hope you have a great day. I'll talk to you soon. Let's go get it.